Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh I am Nur Shahira binti Muhammad Nazir This video is about plan costing Together with my group members Which are Mahira binti Muhammad Rosli Siti Nurdiana binti Diraman And Arba'inah binti Hamsi Will be explained about the introduction of plan costing Capital cost, operation cost And plan economic feasibility For the introduction I will explain about the cost estimation. A cost estimation is the approximation of the cost of a program, operation, or project, and it is the product of the cost estimating process. Therefore, cost estimation in project management is the process of forecasting the cost and other resources needed to complete a project within a defined scope. Cost estimation accounts for each element required for the project and calculates a total amount that determines a project budget. Besides, a cost estimate is more than a list of costs. A detailed report also included to describe the inclusions, accuracy, assumptions, and other aspects that are needed to interpret the total project cost. Cost estimators will take into account some factors that form the basis for their costing decisions. The main factors influencing cost estimating decisions are complexity of the project, market conditions, site constraints, scale and scope of construction, methods of construction, client's financial position, buildability, and location of the project. Moreover, these factors have a direct effect on production performance on site and the performance of the construction itself and consequently must be taken into account in any estimating decisions. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Mahira binti Muhammad Rasti and I'm going to continue with our slide presentation with capital cost. So for the introduction, Capital costs are the costs associated with the building of a new plant or the alteration of an existing plant for the manufacture of chemicals. So uh, there are two techniques used to calculate the total capital cost of a plant, which is long factor technique, a simple technique to estimate the capital cost of a chemical plant, and also module costing technique which is more preferable to a uh, new chemical plant, which is the primary cost for the new chemical plant. So to start off, equipment cost. Our major equipment is the trans reactor R101, which um, where the main process is being processes. So uh, this equipment converts the uh, palm oil, methanol, and catalyst to biodiesel. So this is an important uh, equipment in our plant. So to start up, uh, for the calculation, from table A7, equipment cost data, which I refer from the uh, reference book, analysis, synthesis, and design of chemical process. So um, this table, I extract from the table A7 um, which is the equipment type, equipment description, K1, K2 and K3 and our reactor capacity is about 7,000 7, liter which equivalent to 7 meter cube. Uh, using this equation to find the C, CP0, CP0 is uh, the purchase equipment cost. So the equation is long ten CP naught equal to K1 plus K2 long ten A plus K3 times weight long ten A. And all of that uh, we conclude that CP naught is equal to 1231.56.41517. Uh, this is not the last uh, equation. So for the next one is uh, okay.
from table A7 bear module factors for conveyors crystallizers, crystallizers dryers, dust collectors, filters, mixer, reactors and screen I um, extract the data from the uh, that uh, table uh, this table is also from the reference book analysis synthesis and design of chemical processes well uh, using this uh, equation uh, we can find the bare module equipment cost CBM which is the um, this technique is used uh, the module module out uh, what um, module costing technique uh, this uh, equation is from module costing technique well um, the equation is CBM equal to CP0 times with FBM which can uh, FBM can find from the table so um, the end result is CBM equal to uh, 492,625 um 25.66 which uh is this is in dollars so 492,625 dollars 66 cents um uh, that is the cost of the reactor and for the next one is the land cost our our site selection is from uh Kuantan Pahang so to estimate that the size of our land is about 341,912 feet square. So the Kuantan Pahang land uh, about the price about uh, 50 per square feet. So in total the um the price is about 17,000 17 million. 95,600 ringgit for the total land of our chemical plant so so um, for the total capital cost uh, the price for the reactor is in dollars so we convert it into ringgit measure which became 1,992,600 90, ringgit and 11 cents so in total of the capital cost which include land cost and equipment which is the reactor is only 19,000 19,088,517 ringgit and 11 cents. So uh, that's the total capital cost. And that's all from me. Thank you. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Siti Nordana Binti Dramat. I'll be presenting on operation cost for one year operation. So, for cost of manufacturing, consists of five things, which is cost of raw material, cost of utility, cost of um, wastewater treatment, cost of operating labor, and last one is fixed capital investment. First one is cost of operating labor. Formula use for calculating cost of operating labor is this one and here is stand for number of operator per shift and p here stand for uh, particulate processes and nnp is non particulate example for uh, particulate is like um, transportation and this one is like a process of cooling process or heating process so we fill in the result we get here and the total is 3.08 this here is calculate calculate of uh, how to find the total operator which is number of operator required for one operator per shift is 147 shift uh, total shift per year is 100 uh, sorry 1825 shift per day uh, operator for a single shift is 12.4 shift and total operator we have 38.2 this um we make it the total is 39 so based on the research regarding on operator labor salary in malaysia it's it is rm 12 ringgit uh and 8 cent per how per hour <clears throat> this is based on research so the salary uh 
in one year is to 25,512 ringgit and so we calculate and we multiple with uh, 39 total operator and the total is here so next is cost of utilities and wastewater treatment uh, from here to here is sorry from here to here is uh, for the utilities and here to here is for wastewater treatment this is calculate for unit for one year and also price also for one year and when we sum for all the total is here per year mm. next cost of raw material and fixed capital investment for cost of material uh, we label it as CRM, which is 3,266 per ton, which is uh, for one, sorry, this is for one, one ton, and for one month, we order it for five ton. Uh, the total price is 16,330 ringgit, uh, and for one year is 195,960 and for the fixed capital investment we have calculated it, calculate it and it um the total for all is 1 million 200 250,000 for one year of fixed capital investment uh, i think that's all for operation cost for my part Thank you. Lady Hamsi, and I am going to present on the plan. Okay, first, plan economic feasibility is. Okay, so first is the cash flow diagram. The cash flow diagram is um. Next is the net present value. Net present value. So next is the discounted cash flow rate of return. Next is the discounted payback period. It is the time that it gets this all from me and my group. I hope that um, our